All right, this one's gonna be on STFTP. It's a simple terminal FTP client, so it's a um, incurs um, FTP client. So it busts out here. Uh, so if you type in just the name alone, it'll give you like a little usage help page here, all right? But really simple. If you want to connect to um, your server, um, you know, just type in your IP dash p for the port that you're using and dash u for the username. Not that hard. So right now we're connecting to actually my um, Android phone because I don't really have a FTP server anywhere. But anyway, so if you have a password set up, um, you can type in your password here. So my password, da da da. And now we're connected to my uh, Android phone here. All right. Uh, if you want to get the help page, you hit H, and this will bring up the help page. You know, real simple in here. The only thing that you need to know is mainly your arrow keys. You know, up, down, left, right, and all that. Um, to navigate and upload and go back a folder and all that. Uh, the other hotkey that you really need to know is P and Q, right? So P will switch it to your local view. So this is like, you know, um, like let's say for example, this video, uh, this will be my uh, Linux desktop and the remote view will be my Android, you know, server, uh, FTP server, right? Other stuff you want to know is delete if you want to delete the selected file, right? All these other ones are really just optional, not really that important. But the arrow keys and the P and the Q and the D for delete, that's really all you need to know here. Um, so to toggle between the remote and um, local view, you just hit P, right? And this one is on our local, and this is my downloads folder here. So if we hit Q, uh, this one will switch over to uh, our FTP server here that we're connected to. Uh, so they give you like your IP and all that, right? So P, Q, P, Q, get the idea. Now the thing with this one, I don't know, the hotkeys are kind of stupid because if I hit Q twice, you know, if you do it really fast, Q is also uh, to quit the program. So. <laughs> I don't know why they, you know, roll it into like a tab key for both of them. That would have been uh, more useful. Anyways, um, we'll go back to our server here, the login again. Anyways, avoid hitting Q twice or more than once, um, you know, to uh, to not accidentally quit out of the program. But anyways, how you use this here? Just use your arrow keys to go, you know, inside here, or if you want to go back, hit, you know, uh, left. Or right so let's go back to our downloads folder here so we have only one file here is APK file right now if I want to upload something to my Android uh, we'll switch back to our local view and if I want to upload this uh, HDD logo uh, image here I just hit the right arrow and automatically I'll send it to you know the remote view here All right so now we have two files I send another one what we got here? We got cover image here, whatever. So we, we have three files now, right? So that's really all you gotta do is just hit the arrow. Now, if I want to download something back to my local server uh, from my remote, because right now we don't have the um, FJoy APK or anything like that, right? So we'll do um, this one here and just hit your um, right arrow. And this one uh, will send the fjoy apk to my linux desktop here so now we have this fjoy apk you know downloaded to our local folder here uh, real simple now if you want to delete um, you know you just highlight the one that you want to delete and you hit T and I'll tell you if you want to confirm it you hit yes you know if I don't do it again D yes real simple that's the pro program in a nutshell uh, the only thing with this thing is that you know the only thing I didn't like about it is uh, again the hotkeys toggling you know roll it into one just put it on tab or something like that uh, other things is I don't know you can't really um, highlight multiple files at the same time so it's just one to one um, you know per turn all right uh, no wild cards or anything I don't think they have that um, but anyways that's it for the program if you ever want to use an FTP client uh, right in your terminal a real basic one I would say uh, that's how you use that oh yeah another thing is if you don't have a FTP server to try this on 
uh, and you have an Android phone I'll show you what program I'm using to run this thing here um, so what we got here I'm using this thing called uh, primitive FTPD here uh, you can get this from the F -Droid repositories and it's real simple you know you just go in here and you hit uh, this play icon and it will pop up like your IP address and the port that you need to connect to and you can set up a username and uh, you know a login if you want to but that's a very basic program and um, if you want to try it out with this uh, program you can just use your Android as a temporary FTP server all right anyways that is it for this one um, this is a very old program so it might not be in your repositories but you know you can get it from their link and all that in the description that'll be it for this one